Hello my friend, it is I, Vadim. How are you doing? Today I am going to unbox ASRock B550 PG Riptide motherboard. This motherboard hasn't been released yet officially, uh, they announced it, but it will be hitting the store shelves sometime this month. ASRock didn't give me the exact MSRP for this motherboard, but they did say that it will be costing somewhere between the Pro 4 and Steel Legend B550 motherboards. If you look them up right now, they are uh, Pro 4 is 135 and Steel Legend is 170, so I guess it's gonna be somewhere around 150, 160 probably. But let's have a look what is inside the box. I'm going to put this to the side right now and as always we'll have a look at what kind of accessories come in the box with it and then I will unwrap the motherboard and we'll have a look at that. So we get one, two, three M.2 SSD screws and the standoff for the M.2 NVMe drive. And the usual thing, the guide, CD. All right, let's have a look at the IO shield. This is a good quality IO shield without any of those nasty metal things uh, sticking out. Just black design. Get two SATA cables. And this right here is something a bit special. This is the This is the bracket that attaches to the motherboard and it will hold the GPU in place to, you know, reduce the sag because <laughs> modern GPUs are massive and heavy. So yeah. I'll show you everything about this motherboard in my full review on my main channel, link in the description below. So go and follow that if you're interested in seeing more content on this motherboard. But yeah, I'm not going to touch this today. Um, I'm just kind of showing you what's inside the box. But yeah, this, this, is, this is solid. This is good quality. Now let's have a look at the motherboard. Look at that. a couple of stickers to peel off. This thing looks beautiful. It is all black. What this inspires me to do is to build a blacked out build. Just, you know, pure black 
no RGB. I'm absolutely loving the design. Matte black color is one of my favorites. Uh, this thing right here has a 10 phase power design, a massive beefy heatsink to cool those VRMs. Check it out. Yeah. That thing is huge. And let's have a look at the back of the I.O. It has HDMI 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 9 USB type A ports and 1 USB type C port. There's also a place where you can screw in the antenna for the Wi-Fi. You can buy it separately because look right here, there's a special space for that little uh, Wi-Fi module that you can buy separately for about $20. In terms of storage, it supports six SATA and also one PCIe Gen 4 SSD at the top right here, above the GPU slot, and one more uh, Gen 3 slot NVMe M.2 SSD. I always love to see a lot of fan connectors on the motherboard itself because I hate those hubs, I hate to use the splitters. This thing has two connectors for the CPU fans and one, two, three, four, five connectors for the regular case fans. That's five case fans. Amazing. And you can also connect your RGB lights, of course. You've got two RGB connectors, one here and one there, and two ARGB, addressable RGB connectors, one here down below and one at the top right there. To power the CPU, you've got eight plus two connectors. If you're connecting something that is not power hungry, like, uh, I don't know, Ryzen 5 5600X, 5800X, you can actually use just one 8-pin connector. The other 4-pin connector is just optional. This is what it looks like from the back. Just matte black PCB. Built-in audio looks okay. Nothing fancy, just your average built-in audio with, uh, you know, plenty of connectors over here. And this thing has a lot of USB connectors. One, two, three, four, five. Just look at that light bouncing off of the logo. I can't wait to build a PC with this. I have some memory. Ballistics. It's a black one. So yeah. I am going to build a blacked out version. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like. Comment below if what kind of tests you want to see. What kind of builds you want to see with this motherboard. I have some hardware coming in so I will be able to fulfill some of your requests. It was I, Vadim, until next time.